I'm Sharice Nicole with Coco Fab TV. We are here on the red carpet for the official BET Awards free party hosted by the one and only Miss Deborah Lee. So talk to me about your new gig. Uh, with PacSun. Yes. Yes, so for July 4th we have some t-shirts coming out. Um, I collaborated with photographer Van Styles. We did a little modeling session. So it's me and um, on top of, on, you know, on the front of some t-shirts for the July 4th. So now they are available in PacSun, in store and online. Okay. Yeah. Yes. And you are and you are also working with BET. Yes. Yes. Talk I about did, that. Um, a hosting gig today at the uh, BET Experience, and tomorrow I'm al I'm also hosting the uh, red carpet live stream. So I'm really excited. Yeah, it's kind of big, and I'm just like nervous, but I think it'll be fun. You're getting your hosting on, girl. <laughs> I'm sure. Yeah, I'm trying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Please talk to me about fan reaction because I can't be the only one that's like that that sees you and is like, oh my god. And they run up to you. It's, what, what is it like when fans see you? Uh, it's honestly kind of weird. Like sometimes I'll see a fan and they'll freak out or they'll just like. I was at a Beyonce concert and it, the show had ended and afterwards this girl saw me and she started freaking out and started crying. And I'm like, girl, you just saw Beyonce and you're crying over me like something is wrong. Like it's weird. And you know it's nice because it shows that I have support and influence. So. You know, it's all good. It's all love. <laughs> you, you are a positive person out there. You're somebody that girls can look up to. They love they love you with Chris. They love you guys together. You are like the ultimate love story. We have to see that movie one day, yeah. right? We have that, <laughs> that movie one day, yes. So talk to me about what it was like when he was away and how it feels now that he's back. I mean, it was hard because, you know, I had lonely nights. I was by myself, and it's, you know, it's hard. I've never been in a relationship with somebody that was, in jail so just the communication and just all that it was tough but I'm happy that he's home and you know he's back working on himself and now I'm in a place where I'm working on myself and we're just in a better more mature relationship are we gonna see wedding bells in the future oh girl I don't know about that <laughs> ready to walk down the aisle, girl. I don't know if he's ready <laughs> Thank you. Let's let's make him get ready for you. He's got to he's got to be good enough for you. You better whip him into shape. Right? Exactly. Are you excited to see him perform? Of course. And usually I see, you know, I go to his rehearsals and I see the show. This year I didn't go to any rehearsals and I'm sitting in my seat, so I'm, I'm really excited. I'm sure he's gonna kill it. Yeah. Maybe he'll blow you a kiss or do like a shout out or something. Maybe. Like that. Can you do any? Are, can you do any of the moves? Are you? I've never seen you get it, girl. I'm too left feet. Uh -uh. I leave all the dancing to him. And the singing? Do you guys? That too. Only, only in the shower, right? Right, exactly. Along in the shower, not even with him. Yeah. I limit mine to the shower as well. Right. <laughs> and in the car. <laughs> Getting into acting? Yeah, I've been taking a lot of acting classes. Yeah. Um, We're going to see you on the big screen. Yes, you will see me on the big screen. Okay. Well, maybe you guys can play yourselves in your own. Uh oh. <laughs> really good. <laughs> you want to see that, right? Hey guys, this is Karichi Tran and you're watching Coco Fab. 